Vietnamese hardcore ghost twin. Yeah. Hey Hawks, it's Hillary and Sophia back to give you this week's news. Who's ready for question of the week? Me, except for what is it on? Well, let's go find out with Finn and Matt. I would have a tiger because I don't know, they're cool looking and it'd be fun. I would have a tiger because it's cool. I'd have a tiger because I could have scary pet privileges. If you could have one exotic animal as a pet, what would it be? I would have a quokka because they're really cute and smiley and fluffy. Thank you. Have a good day. <laughs> uh, a liger. What's that and why? Um, watch Napoleon Dynamite and you'll know exactly why. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Probably a zebra so that I could ride it around. Very nice. If you could have one exotic animal as a pet, what would it be? I think that's gotta be a fat orangutan. Why? Well, I just chill out with him, eat bananas all day, and it's a good life. Very nice, thank you. Yes, thank you. Sophia, did you know that Jacko's going to state this weekend in Missoula? What? That's so exciting. Let's see a clip on that. And your ICDC qualifying winners. Both. Yeah! Bozeman High School, Schultz, Schwerin, and Ward in first place from Bozeman High School, Lanes. Sophia, how's your heart doing? Pretty good. Well, let's talk about Heart Healthy Month with Hosa. I'm Hazel and I am a co-president of HOSA. Our challenge this month is Healthy Heart Month and we are trying to spread awareness about ways you can keep your heart healthy. Heart disease is the leading cause of death of men and women in the United States. One person dies every 33 seconds in the U.S. due to cardiovascular disease. About 695,000 people died in 2021 due to heart disease. In order to spread awareness about heart disease, you can educate your fellow peers about ways to keep your heart healthy. Hillary, how did your finals go? They went all right. Same. Let's see how other people felt about their finals this year. What's up, Hawks? It's Rose. And I'm Z, and we're here to see what y'all are getting on the final. <laughs> Let's get into it. Who am I here with? L. Maddie. And what do you think you're going to get on your final? All A's. 100%. Hey Elle, how did you do on your finals? Passed all my classes with all A's. And Maddie graduated, passed all her classes because she's like that. <laughs> Alright, who am I here with? Kayla. Ariana. And what are y'all getting on the final? <laughs> Probably B's. <laughs> like 70s, 60s, yeah, B's. <laughs> I'm scared of B's. <laughs> what did y'all end up getting on your finals? I got B's and A's. Okay. <laughs> How about you? Um, I kind of failed. Yeah, bees. <laughs> it's okay. I got some. I got my English ones and my science ones. Okay, but my math, I failed. <laughs> hey, you got next semester. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Who am I here with? Grant. Sam. And what do you think you're gonna get on your final? An A. A plus. Are you sure about that? Yep. How did you end up doing on your finals? Good. Is that all? Hmm. What's your name? Lucy Morgan. And what do you think you're gonna get on the final? A's and B's. A's. <laughs> How did you do on your final? Failed. Mm. An 89. <laughs> Alright, up here with the Simon Harbor. How do you think you're gonna do on your finals? Oh, I'm pretty good. I only gotta study for math because my grades are pretty good. That's good, that's good. We'll be back. How do we end up doing on our finals? So I actually did pretty good. I ended up acing um, every single one of them. I did really good on math too. It's good to hear. Yep. All right, thank you. 
Hillary, are you ready for trivia? I'm so ready. Me too. Let's watch trivia with Truman and Griffin. What's up, Hawks? It's Griffin. And Truman. And who are we here with today? Zach. Kale McIntosh. Taylor. Alright, Zach, what grade are you in? Fourth. Alright, let's see if you're smart enough to be in fifth grade. First question, who is on the $5 bill? Abraham Lincoln. Lincoln? That is correct. Thomas Jefferson. <laughs> it is not Thomas Jefferson. Right. Next question. Next question. What is the longest river in the continental U.S.? Nah, the Mississippi. That is incorrect. You lose. The Mississippi. Mississippi? Unfortunately, that is incorrect. All right. You still have a chance to win, though. Moving on to your next question. All right. What are the three types of rock? Sedimentary, metamorphic, igneous. Igneous, sedimentary. That is correct. All right, final question. If you get this right, you win. You win a big hug. Uh, what is the prefix in the word uncomfortable? Un. That is correct. All right, bring it in, buddy. Un. That is correct. You win. Congratulations. Gold card applications for semester two can be picked up in the attendance office. They are due by Wednesday, February 7th. To qualify for the gold card, a student must have a 3.75 non-rated GPA from the fall semester. Complete at least 10 hours of community service since the beginning of this school year. Have no unexcused absences at most five excused absences per class. That does not include medical activity, etc. Have no administrative detentions or suspensions. The gold card gives you perks like ability to excuse your own absences up to three times per course, 50% off on VHS dances, and discounts and free items around town. Man, I wish I had a lot of time. Here's your rose, Graham. Sophia and Hillary out. Hey Hawks, we're back with another sports news. Yours truly, Evan, Ago, and Rowan, and let's get into it. For wrestling this week, divisionals today and tomorrow at CMR. Good luck to them. Go Hawks, and hopefully they perform well enough to make it to state tournament. Let's go. Ding dong, it is feeling they are. Never little wanna be gangster, trying to play hard. Tomorrow, our swim team has a crosstown meet against Gallatin. It's in our own pool. Show some support and cheer on our own swim team. Let's go Hawks. Let's go yeah. Hawks. Our basketball team played Belgrade and Senior last week. Our boys beat Belgrade 62 to 50, and they beat Senior 58 to 42. Great job, boys. Good job, boys. Go. Our girls basketball was in two very close games last week, where they beat Belgrade 48 to 47. Great job, girls. Good job, let's go. Here we go. And then later in the week, they played senior on Thursday, where they fought hard but sadly lost 38 to 31. This week, we are playing West tonight and Skyview tomorrow. Our girls are home at 7 tonight, so make sure to show up and support, and our boys are away against West. And then they flip tomorrow, and our boys' basketball are, is home at 2.30, while our girls are away against Skyview. Good luck, basketball. Good luck, girls. Big shout out to Nathan Neal for winning Gatorade Player in Cross Country. Good job. There we go, Nathan. Nathan. Thank you for tuning in to Sports News this week. Uh, we're out. Shout out, Bobo.